Joining me now from Salida, California, veterinarian and congressional candidate for California's 10th district, Ted Howes. Ted, salt of the earth country, that's where you are. A lot of people don't realize this once was until the leadership in Sacramento killed it and cut off all the water. This was the breadbasket of America. Do folks there, your neighbors and, and the people that you're pressing the flesh with, do they want the 45th president removed from office? Uh, absolutely not. First of all, Graham, thank you for having me today. It's an honor. We appreciate it. You know, people within our district, Central Valley of California, like you said, the breadbasket, what they're telling us is this doesn't even rank in their top seven or eight issues. That This is a community that's worried about in California with all of our issues, cost of living, health care, prescription drug prices, really day-to-day -day matters of supporting their families. Impeachment is the last thing on their on their plate. And these are hardworking people, and they need good representation in Washington, D.C., right alongside Nancy Pelosi to almost kind of cancel her out. After all, you know, Nancy Pelosi in San Francisco is only about 150 miles from where you are right now. Are a lot of your folks in favor of getting rid of, for example, the sanctuary state status in California? Oh, well, absolutely. You know, even right here in our district last year, the day after Christmas, we lost Newman police officer Ronnie Singh right. to to a non-citizen who'd been, you know, traveled in and out of the justice system many times. And, and people see that as a tragedy. We support border security in this district. The people that I'm meeting every day, shaking hands with, knocking on doors, they're 100 percent behind securing our country. And California District 10 is not rabid. It's not radical. No. Uh, it's, it's pretty much a reflection of uh, middle America to agree. It's Modesto, for crying out loud. It's American graffiti. Yep. How can you get any this more Americana than that, right? But you, the representative is a guy named Josh Harder, and he has a liberty score, Ted, the guy you're trying to knock off, of F8%, which means he votes 92% against the United States Constitution. He has yep. a 0% rating on the Second Amendment. Are you pro-gun? I, absolutely. I am a pro Second Amendment life member of the NRA. This is the most conservative swing district in the United States, hands down. Our registration here is about a third, a third, and a third, but our independent voters in this valley are still very conservative for the most part. So they've taken notice of what Josh Harder's done. Just here in the last couple of weeks, it's become big news that our representative came out in favor of impeachment, right. and two days later got a $28,200 donation from Adam Schiff. So, you know, you want to talk about a quid pro quo, it actually took place in our district from our representative of Congress. All right, yeah, obvious. You're a vet, not a, a, a veteran, but a veterinarian. Uh, this is 4-H yes, country, uh, effectively, where you are. A lot of 4-Hers, uh, God bless them. And, and I would imagine a lot of people who still believe in liberty and limited government. Yeah, absolutely. And I think that's why my message plays so well, being a constitutional conservative first. And having spent the last 26 years serving the farm communities here as a large animal veterinarian, and it's what's allowed us to build a grassroots base of volunteers, which is probably the largest this district has ever seen. So you know, we're really proud of what we're doing, and uh, we look forward to flipping this district back to red in 2020. TedHouse.com, that's H-O-W-Z-E, House, TedHouse.com, if folks want to get more information or possibly help out this effort to, to flip another district in California. Ted, good luck. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One America News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.